Hi, let's create this simple marquee effect without using the marquee tag. Here in the HTML file, we'll add a div and we'll give it a class of marquee. Inside this div, we'll add another div and this div will contain the text. I have some text pasted here and that's all we need for the HTML. Now let's go to our CSS file and add a few styles. First, we'll select the div with the class of marquee and we'll give it a width of 80%. We'll give it a background color of violet. We'll set the text transform to uppercase. Now let's vertically and horizontally center the text. So we'll give the body a few styles. First, we'll give it a height of 100 VH. We'll set the display to flex. We'll set the justify content to center. We'll align the items to the center. Now let's style the div which contains the text. So I'll select the class of marquee and I'll select the div within it. First, I'll increase the font size to 3 rem. Next, I'll choose a font family of Verdana. Now in the browser, you can see that the text is wrapping to the next line. So we'll go to the div with the class of marquee and we'll set the white space to no wrap. Now you can see that the text is in a single line. Now let's create an animation rule. I'll make some space at the bottom. I'll say keyframes and I'll name this animation as animate. So at 100%, we want to set the transform to translate 100% on the X axis and zero on the Y axis. Now let's apply this animation to our div. So I'll say animation, animate, the duration will be 5 seconds. The animation timing function will be linear and we want this animation to go on. But you can see that the animation keeps on restarting even before it has moved completely off to the left side. So to avoid this, here's what we can do. We'll give this div a padding to the left of 100%. And we'll set the display to inline block. And now our animation moves smoothly. But the duration of 5 seconds may seem a bit too fast. So we'll increase it to 10 seconds. And finally, let's set the overflow to hidden for the div with the class of marquee. So we'll go to the top and we'll say overflow hidden. And finally, we have a simple marquee effect without using the marquee tag. So that's all for this video. I'll see you in another one. Till then, have a nice day.